Students, teachers, faculty and staff, parents and guardians, a very blessed morning to each and everyone. Welcome to our 23rd Moving Up Recognition and Graduation Ceremony. To start our online virtual program, may we request everybody to stand for our opening prayer to be followed by the singing of the Philippine National Anthem, Panunumpa sa Watawat ng Pilipinas, Pledge to the Bible, Pledge to the Christian Flag, Singing of the Capis Hymn, and Arrows. of you, Lord, it would be peace here on earth, here on earth. as gentle as your children's laughter all around, all around. Mga kababayan, ang pampansang awit ng Pilipinas. Ayang maginiw, kaya sa sikahanan, alam ng puso sa titik mo'y buhay. Lupang pinirang, tuyang ka ng magiging, sa manlulupin, di ka pasisigil, sa nagatang tutok sa simoy at sa namin mo. Panunumpa sa watawat ng Pilipinas. Ako ay Pilipino, buong katapatan na nanunumpa sa watawat ng Pilipinas at sa bansang kanyang sinasagisag na may dangal, katarungan at kalayaan na ipinakikilos ng sambayanang makajos, makakalikasan, makatao at makabansa. Pledge to the Bible I pledge allegiance to the Bible, God's Holy Word. I will make it a lamp unto my feet and a light unto my path. I will hide its words in my heart that I may not sin against God. Pledge to the Christian flag. I pledge allegiance to the Christian flag and to the Savior for whose kingdom it stands. One Savior, crucified, risen, and coming again with life and liberty for all who believe.
So, pray that all. 
Congratulations to all students, parents, teachers, and staff of Mambusao Christian Center Academy for reaching this 23rd Moving Up Recognition and Graduation Ceremony with the theme, Enlarge the Vision. Congratulations, graduates, for your perseverance and determination to reach the success in the race you are running in. Despite the pandemic, despite all trials in sickness and in health, God has preserved each one of us together, enduring the trials and in the end, reaping the fruits of our labor. You have encountered boredom and hardships on how to communicate with your teacher or teachers, not to mention the flaws in connectivities of our internet and the money we spend in buying internet loads in order to experience the essence of education. But all these things have been overcome with the help of God. Children, always remember what the Lord said in John 4.4, 4, Ye are of God, little children, and have overcome them, because greater is he that is in you than he that is in the world. So always remember that God, that God is greater in you, and you can overcome every trial, everything that comes your way, because the Lord is with you. We don't know the end of this pandemic. But we trust God that it will happen soon. Have hope, friends, brothers, and sisters. We are together in this. Nothing is impossible when we pray and trust God. Again, congratulations and God bless everyone. Good morning, everyone, and welcome to this year's 23rd Moving up recognition and graduation ceremonies of the Mambusa Christian Center Academy. It is a great pleasure to greet you. Happy day, especially to our graduating students and also to the um, awardees. To all parents, friends, guardians, and relatives of our work. Awardees and honorees, we are glad that we have come to this point of the ceremony. This is the culminating activity of the Mabusa Christian Center Academy, and we are glad that we have come this far. Despite the pandemic that uh, has uh, caused havoc to our uh, school system, not only our school, but throughout the educational system of the Philippines in the whole world, we are really affected by this pandemic. However, despite these um, bad happenings in our society, in our environment, we still manage to come up with uh, what is expected of us at our best. Our uh, teachers have gone so far 
in their uh, way of delivering services, educational services to our students. And um, of course, we are glad that we have delivered services to the best of our ability and to, be to the best of our capacity. And so this morning, we, this is another milestone in the history of MCCA because uh, it is unique because this uh, ceremony is done virtually. And so uh, we are uh, thankful that despite the situation, we are having this ceremony. Our theme for th this year as in the SOT theme is enlarge your border. The Lord has commanded us to enlarge our border. And this year, we are going far and wide. And it is a challenge for us, not only geograph geographically, but also in terms of our influence. The Mambusa Christian Center Academy has been established 23 years ago through the leadership of our former pastor, Reverend Rujeto Domingo. And he has uh, in his heart, he had in his heart the value of uh, educating students in the Word of God. Because the Word of God says in Proverbs chapter 3 verses 5 and 6 or in, in, the, in, the, in the book of Proverbs, it says, Train up a child while they are young and when they are old, they will not depart from it. And so, we are in this mandate of God's Word to train up a child. And the, the training is not only in terms of intellectual training or in terms of physical or in terms of uh, social, but of course, we are training our children to be um, to develop in their character the character traits of the Bible, the character traits of Jesus Christ. And so, uh, one of the awards that we will be giving today is on the, their character traits. Each person is unique, and each person has its character traits that God is giving them and that they have uh, imbibed in their spirit the, the, the Word of God. And so, in, in terms of enlarging or enlargement of the borders, it's not only geographical. Of course, we are trying to expand it into other, uh, our influence uh, of God's Word. We are trying to in expand it in other places, but uh, um, we are trying to, to establish in our, the hearts of our children to expand their knowledge on the different skills and, competi uh, and uh, competence that the school in their grade has established. Their goals in their academic, uh, academic uh, aspects. And um, we are glad that we have this in mind. And I hope that this will be continued even next year, even in the years to come. Because our uh, school is mandated to this uh, very core of helping our parents 
to train their children to be good citizens of the society. We are training future godly leaders of our society. And so, this morning, uh, we are, uh, or this day, we are uh, glad to give awards to our students. We are glad to give recognition to them. And we will be uh, giving awards or, or certificates to our graduates. So to our parents, to our supporters, thank you very much for your efforts, even uh, for our uh, scholarship uh, sponsors. We are so thankful that um, you have uh, helped us in this endeavor. To our uh, principal, Mrs. Uh, Laurel Ligada, thank you for uh, your efforts and to all our teachers, your sacrifices, and to our parents, your support to make this school a better school where your children or our children will be trained and holistically in every aspect of their lives. Thank you very much and congratulations to our pupils and their respective parents. God bless you and happy viewing to everyone. So despite the pandemic, we can see that our beloved students continue to persevere and adapt in their studies, be it online, through modules, or visitations. The students gained achievements and awards which we will know today. But first, let us explain the award certificates to be given. First is the Accomplishment Certificate. Accomplishment Certificate will be given to all students to signify the number of places they have finished in the school year 2020-2021. Honor A is given to students who has finished 84 paces in their chronological age level. Special awards is given to students who have finished at least 63 paces for the whole school year 2020-2021, not necessarily in their chronological age level. For GPA or grade point average, with honors will be given to students with a grade point average of 90 to 94.4%. With high honors are those poor students with a grade point average of 94.5 to 97.4, while with highest honors will be given to students with a grade point average of 97.5 to 100%. And it is also required that those who will receive grade point average awards must have finished at least 84 paces. For a thousand clubs, a thousand clubs is given to students who have garnered 10 or more perfect scores or 100% in their pace test. Top 1, 2, and 3 is obtained from their grade point average in comparison. Also, be reminded that all of our students will receive an achievement medal. Timothy Edric D. Labau. Timothy Edric D. Labau will receive an academic award, Honor A, and Achievement Medal. He will also receive ribbons for the following character traits dependable, diligent, fair, equitable, and flexible. Kinder 1 Simon Noah F. Gregory. Simon Noah F. Gregory will receive an academic award, accomplishment certificate, achievement medal, and honor A. He will also receive ribbons for the following character traits. Flexible, faithful, different, fair, and efficient. Chadi Raj L. Domingo. Chadi Raj L. Domingo will receive an academic award, accomplishment certificate, achievement medal, honor A, and top one in kinder one. He will 
also receive ribbons for the following character traits. Determined, flexible, faithful, dependable, and diligent. Eric John S. Barrientos. Sarik John S. Barrientos will receive an academic award, accomplishment certificate, achievement medal, and honor B. He will also receive ribbons for the following character traits. Fair, faithful, forgiving, dependable, and discerning. Shania Jean G. Barrenos. Shania Jean G. Barrenos will receive an academic award, accomplishment certificate, achievement medal, and honor A. She will also receive ribbons for the following character traits. Fair, diligent, forgiving, dependable, and equitable. Jean Monique A. Soriano Jean Monique A. Soriano will receive an academic award, accomplishment certificate, achievement medal, and honor A. She will also receive ribbons for the following character traits. Faithful, forgiving, dependable, discreet, and Fearless. Kinder 2. Ulysses Grant K. Manayon. Ulysses Grant K. Manayon will receive an academic award, certificate of completion, achievement medal, and special award. He will also receive ribbons for the following character traits. Determined, diligent, efficient, equitable, and fair. Chanli B. Ladok. Chanli B. Ladok will receive an academic award, certificate of completion, achievement medal, and special award. He will also receive ribbons for the following character traits. Determined, diligent, fearless, flexible, and fair. Paula S. Dumail. Paula S. Dumail will receive academic award, certificate of completion, Achievement Medal, Special Award, Highest Pace Average, Top 1 in Kinder 2. She will also receive ribbons for the following character traits. Determined, Diligent, Fearless, Flexible, and Fair. Nathan Luis L. Dujeno Nathan Luis L. Dujeno will receive an Academic Award, Certificate of Completion, Achievement Medal, and Special Award. He will also receive ribbons for the following character traits. Diligent, Efficient, Equitable, and Flexible. Grade 1, Luisa Marie Escalada. Luisa Marie Escalada will receive an accomplishment certificate for completing 35 bases and Club 1000 for garnering 15 perfect scores or 100% in her face test. She will also receive ribbons for the following character traits. Determined, discreet, efficient, fair, and flexible. Tiffany Kish Paeldin. Tiffany Kish Paeldin will receive an accomplishment certificate for completing 63 paces. Special Award with a pace average of 97.39%, Club 3000 for garnering 33 perfect scores or 100% in her pace test, and the top one for Grade 1. She will also receive ribbons for the following character traits. Determined, Diligent, Equitable, Fearless, and Flexible. Grade 2, Sarah Joy Domingo. Sarah Joy Domingo will receive an accomplishment certificate for completing 84 paces, Honor A, highest pace average, with a pace average of 98.05%, with highest honors, for having a grade point average of 97.58%, Club 4000 for garnering 49 perfect scores or 100% in her pace test. And top 1 for grade 2. 
she will also receive ribbons for the following character traits. Faithful, flexible, dependable, discreet, and forgiving. Rihanna Jean Estocada. Rihanna Jean Estocada will receive an accomplishment certificate for completing 79 paces and a special award with a pace average of 93.95%. She will also receive ribbons for the following character traits. Flexible, dependable, fearless, diligent, and forgiving. Chris James Latosa. Chris James Latosa will receive an accomplishment certificate for completing 122 paces with high honors with a grade point average of 94.97%. Special award with a pace average of 94.88%. And the highest number of paces completed. He will also receive a Club 2000 for garnering 24 perfect scores or 100% in his pace test. He will also receive ribbons for the following character traits. Flexible, Forgiving, dependable, fearless, and equitable. Jinrich Jill Nunez. Jinrich Jill Nunez will receive an accomplishment certificate for completing 102 paces. With the honors with a grade point average of 94.94%. Special award with a pace average of 95.22%. And a club 2000 for garnering 24 perfect scores or 100% in her pace test. She is also top 3 for grade 2. She will also receive ribbons for the following character traits. Faithful, dependable, fearless, diligent, and forgiving. Alexa Gail Oreta. Alexa Gail Oreta will receive an accomplishment certificate for completing 69 paces. Special award with a pace average of 95.5% and a club 2000 for garnering 22 perfect scores or 100% in her pace test. She will also receive ribbons for the following character traits. Fair, flexible, different, fearless, and equitable. Hannah Janine Villegas Hannah Janine Villegas will receive an accomplishment certificate for completing 102 paces with high honors with a grade point average of 97% special award with a pace average of 98% club 6000 for garnering 63 perfect scores or 100% in her pace test the highest number of perfect scores the second highest number of paces completed, and the top two for grade two. She will also receive ribbons for the following character traits. Faithful, fearless, diligent, discreet, and equitable. Grade three, Azalaya Nisi Bantilio. Azalaya Nisi Bantilio will receive an accomplishment certificate for completing 84 paces, with honors with a grade point average of 94.36%, special award with a pace average of 94.85%, and club 1000 for garnering 16 perfect scores or 100% in her pace test. She will also receive ribbons for the following character traits. Pendable, determined, diligent, efficient, and flexible. Kishandra Joy Ferrer Kishandra Joy Ferrer will receive an accomplishment certificate for completing 102 paces with honors, with a GPA, or grade point average of 93.61%, special award with a pace average of 94.12%, club 1000 for garnering 14 perfect scores or 100% in her pace test and top one for grade 3. She will also receive ribbons for the following character traits mainly dependable, diligent, 
determined, faithful, and flexible. Grade 5, Sarek John Constantino. Sarek John Constantino will receive an accomplishment certificate for completing 56 paces and for being top 1 for grade 5. He will also receive ribbons for the following character traits. Flexible, dependable, efficient, fair, and diligent. Grade 6, Margarita Duzain Latosa. Margarita Duzain Latosa will receive an accomplishment certificate for completing 33 paces. Club 1000 for garnering 14 perfect scores or 100% on her face test. She will also receive a certificate of completion as graduate. Also, she will receive ribbons for the following character traits. Fair, flexible, discerning, discreet, and determined. John Ryan Lantoria. John Ryan Lantoria will receive an accomplishment certificate for completing 30 paces and certificate of completion as graduate. He will also receive ribbons for the following character traits. Forgiving, discerning, fearless, different, and fair. And last but not the least, Gail Shaina Murata. Gail Shaina Murata will receive an accomplishment certificate for completing 57 paces and a certificate of completion as graduate. She is also the top one for our grade 6. Also, she will receive ribbons for the following character traits. Forgiving, flexible, dependable, efficient, and discerning. For all students, congratulations! Good day to each and everyone who is uh, attending virtually present at this time of our graduation ceremonies for our beloved and uh, very precious uh, graduates uh, for the school year which ends at this uh, time. First of all, I'd like to greet the parents and family members without whose sacrifices, whose uh, reminders, and whose participation in the learning process for our uh, graduates have resulted in this culmination uh, program. Uh, this year, your role has changed uh, drastically, where we've always thought We've always believed that the matter of educating our children rests nearly exclusively on our teachers and our staff. This time, you parents, you family members, you who are in the households of our learners have expanded your role and contributed to this wonderful day wherein finally, finally, our learners are graduating in this culmination exercise. So congratulations, because this year has not been very easy, has not been a, a picnic for our teachers, for our family members, as well, uh, especially the parents, mothers, fathers, sisters, brothers, and all who have contributed to the uh, achievement of our learners at this time. So, maraming salamat at congratulations, parents and family members. Mas malaki ang role ninyo at this time compared to earlier graduation exercises. Secondly, I would also like to greet our teachers without whose very uh, careful uh, review and careful supervision of the work of our pupils and our learners, 
this event would not have take would not be taking place um, at all and so thank you teachers your role has also expanded in addition to seeing to it that the modules are faithfully followed the assignments are correctly uh, implemented and the learners are truly learning and you have had to deal with new ways of assessing the performance also of the learners so congratulations teachers for enduring for your patience for your love for our learners and your willingness to engage in a way and methods of teaching which are different from those which are used Oh,